A Great Lakes Bay Invitational hit the links this morning at Midland Country Club, and there are several local connections in this tournament. We start with a former Spartan, Valerie Plata. She played for Michigan State from 2018 to 2022. Here's her approach shot on 11. Her partner would miss the putt for birdie, but Plata would tap it in for par. They'd finish six over. Chris Tamales from Lapeer set up her partner for a birdie putt, and Brittany Altomer would finish it off. They'd shoot one over in round one. Now to Midland's own Kim Din. She taps in for par on 11, but her highlight of the day came on 18. In front of her hometown fan, she buries a birdie putt. Her team finished one over on the day, and she enjoyed every second. So much fun. Um, you don't get to play home games a lot um, in golf. So every time I get to play at home, it's a it's a pleasure. And so getting to do it a second time around has been so much fun. Um, so many friends, so many volunteers I know, so many colleagues from work. Um, it's just a lot of fun to have family, friends, and everyone out here supporting us. We got off to a good start. We played some really good holes. Um, had just had a couple loose bogeys, but we're right in this. And you know we're not happy, just happy to be here. We're out here to compete and make the cut and place well. Highly ranked players were in full force in mid Michigan. Brooke Henderson is ranked 12th in the world. She taps in for par on 12. She and Lexi Thompson finished three over. The highest ranked player in the tournament is Ronnie Yin. She's ranked fifth in the world. She taps in for par. Her team would shoot two over in round one. Everyone is chasing this group though. Kelly Tan going to drill this birdie putt at the ninth green. She and her teammate finished six under on the day and they are the leaders in the clubhouse, but several groups are right behind them. Ten duos are all within three shots. TV 